Facebook message. This is a new video. Somehow the video, okay. Somehow I stopped that video and started a new one. This is good. I've been talking about synchronicity. So out of the blue today, I get a Facebook message from a guy who I absolutely couldn't remember, but much hours later I remembered. He's that annoying person from church. Oh my God, that guy was so annoying. And there he was out of the blue saying, you did not have my permission to do this and I want you to take it down. I had absolutely no idea who he was. I didn't recognize him from his picture on Facebook. And I sent back a, a, a mildly polite reply saying, I have absolutely no idea who you are or what, quotes this, quotes is. If you tell me what that is that I did that you're annoyed with, I probably will be glad to take it down. And then he wrote back later on, it was, he says, it's on my homepage. And then I recognized the name and I said, it's that, I haven't had anything to do with that. I haven't been in the church there for four years. What the hell is he annoyed with me about now from four years ago? So I sent him a note saying, not saying I remember who you are, but saying, <coughs> I have to admit that I'm kind of got my hands full living my life in Mexico and Whatever this is you're talking about is not a real high priority for me, but I will try to find time when I have some downtime. And then I thought, no, that's not enough for pulling this guy's chain. So still not acknowledging that I know what a jerk he is anyway. I said, are you sure you are living your life to its fullest <laughs> that this is even a thing to you? And I went, yes, boom chakalaka. That's just the coup de gras I wanted right there. <laughs> As someone who loves all beings and is will not rest until all beings are at peace, and my notion of that asshole being at peace is for him to go the fuck away and leave me alone, whatever the hell he wants to do. Okay, so that's your spiritual uplift message for the day from Orizaba.